So my dear young people, I'm aware that on the 28th of this month, there is going to be a public lecture at Christ the King Parish in the evening at 6.30. And uh, it will be dealing with the responsibilities of the Ghanaian youth, prospects and challenges. Whenever I think of the youth, I just thank God for giving us so many of you more than 65% of the Ghanaian population is below the age of 35. Youthful, exuberant, idealistic, ready to add unto the good things that have been done in this country. So, you know, just as Jesus, we are told in the Gospel of St. Mark, chapter 10, verse 21, looked at the young man and loved him. I just want you to know you are lovely. God loves you. Jesus Christ loves you. But God loves you because of how much potential he has put in you. How much talent he has given to you. So come, let us sit together. Let us look at what our responsibilities are for the future. Let us look at the challenges that are confronting the young people today. And let us find new ways of doing what the Lord wants us to do, to make Ghana a better place. I've always believed in the name Ghana. God has a new agenda. And God has this new agenda. And only the new people, the young people, only you can fulfill it. So I hope to see you there. Let's sit. Let's think. Let us see what each and every one of you can do so that your light may shine and give glory to the Heavenly Father. God bless you.